Right, here we go again. Derby away, eight goals conceded in our last two league games. And not to forget a loss on penalties in the semi-final of the Papa John's Trophy. It's not been a good couple of weeks. Don't worry, it's not the end of the world. We head to Derby away. It's not like they score loads of goals. I don't get nervous, but I'm starting to get a bit shaky, you know what I mean? I'm a little bit weak. And not to worry, their team's mediocre. They've got the likes of David McGoldrick, Barkhausen, Knight, Mendes Lang. It's not the end of the world. Oh, I'm fucking shitting myself. In all seriousness, I am really not looking forward to today, regardless of it being a huge away day for a club of our size. Derby County sits 6th in League 1. The only positive is that they are on a bit of a wobble in terms of form, with two losses and a draw in their last five. But you've got to add in a 5-0 thumping of Morecambe and a 2-0 victory over a solid Charlton side. <sighs> now get to the point where I've got to talk about our form. We currently sit 19th in League 1, at two points clear of the relegation zone, and our form is, well, crap. The only positive performance we've had in recent times was the one all draw in 90 minutes against Plymouth Argyle in what Tommy would say is the Stuff Crust Cup. I don't give a toss about the Stuff Crust Cup. Why score prediction? We're going to lose 4 0 again, and I hate to say it but it is absolutely abysmal at the moment and there's no confidence around the club. Derby County are a great club. They've got a massive fan base who have stuck with the club through thick and thin and are reaping the fruits of their labour now with a solid first season in League One. They've got great history and if we get anything today, it's an absolute bloody miracle. Your score predictions will be on the screen now. How many are we conceding today then? Let's head to Derby and find out. So the lineups are now out. Glenn Ray starts, which is a positive. I thought he was decent when he came on on Saturday. Then again, does that say a lot about him or the team? I don't know. Um, Keener on the bench. So I'll be going with one up top, probably. Ollie Inca starts, which is a big plus. Raglan dropped to the bench. So we've clearly switched it up a bit, formation wise. Hopefully, we don't try and play with the same tactics, which would be the most challenging thing I've ever seen. But there we go. Only time will tell. We'll have to wait and find out. It's not a bad lineup, so fingers crossed the lads camp out a half decent performance. But yeah, let's go to kick off. Oh, 
at half time. Derby won shot. No, the scoreline is not that bad, but the performance is tragic, to be honest. I don't want to be that guy because 1 0 away at a side like Derby it is really nothing to be ashamed of. But it's poor. It's, it's poor again. Uh, Broom looks. I'll be honest, Broom looks awful out on the right, and it's not his fault. He's been played in about four positions in the last three weeks. How do you expect him to find consistency? He persists with playing Jacko. Why are you playing Ryan Jackson in centre back? We can't cope with balls in from the wing. We absolutely can't cope. Jack Watts, you've stood here. I wanted to watch. So you've got to give your thoughts on that for No, I want to speak to you. Um, we weren't terrible, but. We weren't terrible, but we weren't great. May looked isolated. Yeah. Um, Perry isn't having a good game. Uh, it's, Perry, not, it's not No, good. no. It's, not it, it's, yeah, it's hard to put into words for me today. We're, we're, we're struggling with balls into the box, though, aren't we? It's yeah, yeah. It could, could, easy, they, could have scored, they could have scored about three. Um, we've had one shot. It's been hopeless. And like he says, May, May's been isolated, so... There's, I've got absolutely no hope for the second half. But game plan is key. Game plan is key. What, what will the game? Yeah, exactly. What game plan will it be? What game plan? Uh, probably none. Damage limitation. Let's go second half. Then full time, Derby two, Charlton nil. Uh, the, to be honest, the result is not bad. The result is not bad, but I don't want to take anything away from Derby. I think that they, they, they weren't their best today, but they they outplayed us still. Um, Derby fans in class as well, fair play. Top fan base, like I said at the start of the video, uh, and they deserve everything coming your way. And I hope you go up as well. Um, but we I don't know where I stand on the Wade situation, but what I'd say is change has been needed and I've wanted change in terms of tactics, in terms of the way we set up for about four months now, four or five months, but nothing's changed. Alf. Shit. That's all I can say. He's not wrong. He's not wrong. Um... Disappointing, very disappointing. Something's got to change. Tactics, man at the helm. But well, we got we got two massive games coming up. Two games that we need to be getting points from. Fleetwood and Lincoln. And if not, 
I feel like that's our League One campaign over already. I don't know why we're sitting the table after that. But I can only imagine it doesn't look good. Um, but that's football. We move on to the next. We've got to keep moving. It's not looking good. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I've crashed yesterday. Please like and subscribe if you did enjoy. I've crashed yesterday. I'll see you in the next one.